Looking ahead on Marketplace, I was joined in the kitchen by Hope and Cured Catering to give you a sneak peek of what to expect for food at the Style of Hope Fashion Show. Plus, I sat down with Gruning Health and Wealth to fill you in on Medicare and how important the fall season is for you to review your annual plan. Hi everyone, it is Monday, September 16th, and it sure as heck feels like a Monday. Thank you for joining News Channel 20 Marketplace. I'm Benny Harmony. We have a great show ahead, so grab your coffee, relax, and let's get into our trending stories. First up, where are my TikTok addicts at? Because it's one of my weaknesses, so you guys don't have to feel bad. Today, a U.S. appeals court will hold oral arguments about a law that would ban TikTok in the United States. Congress passed a bill last April that President Biden signed into law. The ban would take effect mid-January unless TikTok's ownership changes. ByteDance is a Chinese-based company, and the United States is demanding ByteDance divest itself from TikTok. But the company says not so fast. It is challenging the law, saying it violates free speech rights in the United States. The company says even if divested, it cannot happen by the deadline Congress has set. About 150 million people use TikTok in the United States. Last but not least, our favorite prince, Prince Harry, is celebrating a milestone birthday. Yesterday, he turned 40. The British prince is estranged from other members of the royal family. He'll mark the occasion at the private celebration of his home in Southern California, or he did yesterday, where he lives with his wife, Meghan Markle, and their two children. Sources say Harry is looking ahead with excitement. Those are your trending stories for today. We have an amazing show ahead. Marketplace is back in two. See you soon. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.